and will live safe and secure in your land. I'll make the country a place of peace. You'll be able to go to sleep at night without fear. I'll get rid of the wild beast. I'll eliminate war. You'll chase out your enemies and defeat them. Five of you will chase a hundred, and a hundred of you will chase 10,000 and do away with them. I'll give you my full attention. I'll make sure you prosper. Make sure you grow in numbers. And keep my covenant with you in good working order. You'll still be eating from the last year's harvest when you have to clean out the barns to make room for the new crops. Yes, I'll set up my residence in your neighborhood. Without fear, 
I'll get rid of the wild beast. I'll eliminate war. You'll chase out your enemies and defeat them. Five of you will chase a hundred, and one hundred of you will chase ten thousand and do away with them. I'll give you my full attention. I'll make sure you prosper. Make sure you grow in numbers and keep my covenant with you in good working order. You'll still be eating from last year's harvest when you have to clean out the bars to make room for the new crops. I'll set my residence in your neighborhood. I won't avoid or shun you. I'll stroll through your streets. I'll be your God. You'll be my people. I am God, your personal God, who rescued you from Egypt so that you would no longer be slaves to the Egyptians. I ripped off the harness of your slavery so that you can move about freely. Leviticus 26, verse 3 through 13. Thus says the Lord.
So 